With the new automated indoor braking analyzer, Continental has taken a major step forward in test technology for summer and winter tyres. The new facility at the Contidrome test track is integrated in a hall that's 300 metres long and up to 30 metres wide. In a fully automated process, it's now possible to conduct testing 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, irrespective of weather or other external factors. What we in principle do is, first of all, we somehow connect a car to a rail-guided system. This rail-guided system ensures that the car is transported to the launch point, where then with a linear accelerator, the car can be accelerated within seconds up to speed, 120 for dry braking, 110, or 85 km per hour for wet braking. Then a full automated braking takes place at a defined surface. That's also a very interesting innovation. We can exchange surfaces, so there is 75 meter, 2.5 meter width surfaces of a weight of 120 tons, which you just can be exchanged. Yeah, the IBA was exactly foreseen to improve the test precision, because especially in development, we really get the results which we need to decide is a new specimen better or worse. We of course cooperate with different companies, like the rail guided system is coming from the uh, roller coaster technology. The hydraulic system to lift these 120 tons is done with specific companies. And the linear motor, for example, the linear accelerator, that was a very specific design which had never been done before. It is, I would call it, a revolution in tire testing. We are convinced that with this machine, we can develop tires much faster and much more on the point because we don't go in the wrong direction, that's the point. So it will have give us a chance to be better than our competitors and to be faster. And that's exactly what is needed in a very changing environment. And then beyond that, there is really a whole myriad of possibilities which uh, we see looking at uh, things like what temperatures are the best with which surface conditions, with which atmospheric conditions. We can effectively transport the world into Conti Drome, so close to Hanover we can create the uh, different conditions of the world. So it's relevant for the whole corporation, um, all countries, all regions, we can uh, make the conditions appropriate for the development and also for different uh, functions such as brakes, such as different systems we could uh, uh, imagine to test here, not just for tyres indeed. To give some examples, we think of putting only one corner, so just one tyre with one spring damper and one ABS control system on it. It can be a passenger car tyre, it can be maybe in future also a truck tyre. We let it run under a specific slip angle, camber angle, and can do realistic force and moment measurements like we nowadays only can do in machines on realistic surfaces. So this offers us, for example, a complete new world of validating our simulation procedures for vehicle dynamics. Of course, our first objective is to optimize tires and other systems within Continental. But beyond that, then, if we have capacity and we have a good um, exchange with our customers, as we know we have, then there is potential to optimize with the customer, get a deeper understanding for the vehicle, their philosophy, and be able to even optimize their products in a better way in the future. Well, the IBA comes exactly to a very good timing. Today, we have a new law in place for the EU tire label, and this requires, for example, the wet braking needs to be measured. If you have good testing devices, you can test very precisely.